right, you don't like contests, or maybe you want to get away from the contest during the weekend and use the walk bands. Now, I'm a, I'm a fan of 12 metres and 17 to a degree as well, and I've come up with an antenna design you can use that will allow you to use both bands on one antenna without any radials as a vertical. Stay tuned. So the antenna itself is pretty easy to make. You need to make one of these, but I'll talk about this in a minute. This is a loading coil, all right? But what you have is that at the bottom of the antenna, say it's a vertical, you have like a 56 to one or a 49 to one transformer, an NFET half wave transformer. Up from there, you'll then have basically a full uh, length half wave for the higher band. So let's say, again, we're, we're avoiding contests. We're looking at 12 meters and the length of that wire would be something like about 5.7 meters. Now, what you do is you cut it to the full half wave length, stick the coil at the top. So basically the coil, the, the, the wire will come down here. All right. Don't attach anything to this one yet. I'll come back to that in a second. All right. But what you're effectively doing is that you are then tuning that longer bottom part of the antenna, which is your full sized half wave, effectively, for your higher band, all right? So just cut it, keep the coil attached, and then you should have a good SWR, normal really SWRs you'll find for a half wave for that higher band. In this case, it'll be 12 meters, the 12 meter band. At the top then, attach some wire. Now, uh, when I did this, and I've uh, got some examples here, I've got this in a very natty bag look, but effectively what I found was with a 21 microhenry coil, and uh, by the way, to make one of these, I'll come back to that in a second, but there's 21 microhenries here, okay? At the very top of the 12 meter, the lower part, effectively, if you add, just looking at my notes, 14 centimeters, which for you guys in the States is what? Five and a half inches or something, quite six inches in prune, okay? Something like that. At the very top, then effectively, that should give you close to 17 meters. And when you have to prune this, make it longer, the top bit, and then just every just take a centimeter off at a time because the tuning will be quite sharp, okay? But effectively, what you'll then have is a two band half wave, okay? For 12 and 17 meters. The overall length of the antenna, including the length of this coil, is something I think in the region it'll be less than six meters, it'll be about 5.8, 5.9 meters or something. Now, your mileage may vary, it depends on the type of on, on how much loading your transformer gives you at the bottom. This gives you a little bit of loading as well for the bottom wire, but not much. But it will basically make the, the lower frequency, the top wire, a lot more, a uh, lot shorter. Okay, now how do you make one of these? Pretty simple. Get some PVC pipe. I think this is 25 millimeter pipe, about an inch for you guys in the States, something like that. Drill a couple of holes, M4, uh, washers, nuts, bolts, whatever. And then what you then do is you just wind the wire and attach them. Okay, this is the coil. And then what you then do is attach the elements top and bottom. All right, just attach your elements. Uh, now, the golden uh, question is how many turns and what do I have to do? Now, there's a very good link to a website that will give you a design which will be very, very close to this for you, all right? So if you're going for this particular design, go onto that website, you put in the diameter of your coil, what wire are you using, what gauge of wire, this is 26 gauge, how many turns you need, and basically go and experiment. Now, 21 microhenries isn't utterly critical. If you go for something like 18 or 19 microhenries, 17 microhenries, that's absolutely fine. Bearing in mind, the top element will be slightly longer, okay? Any more than 21 microhenries, you want it two more because then you probably might find you have too much inductance and you can't get 17 meters, okay? So just be wary of that. But something around 20 to 23 microhenries, something like that should do you quite quite fine. So don't be too het up if you're, if you're on 22 microhenries. It should work pretty well. You'll find that the, the centimeter wire will be a bit shorter, okay? So there we are. It's as simple as that, right? And you'll get two bands. Don't forget, but then fed half waves, there's a, there's a harmonic relationship between bands. 12 and 17 aren't harmonically related, but you'll get them both on the same antenna, okay? So there we go. Simple as that. SWR, by the way, 12 meters, not a problem. Absolutely fine. You'll be uh, well under 1.3, 1.2 to 1 for the whole band, because both bands are fairly narrow. 17 meters, well under 1.5 to 1. Okay, guys, well, thanks for watching. There's another video coming up over there somewhere and a chance to subscribe down there. All the best to you. Catch you again for another one. 73 and enjoy your day. Bye-bye now.